one of the most common species of fish in the Mississippi Sound is the hardhead catfish. Not to be confused with the freshwater channel catfish that we often have when we have a fish fry, the hardhead catfish lives in salt water, specifically the Mississippi Sound. They have a very unique way of reproducing. Most fish will distribute their eggs into the water. Hardhead catfish, however, do something very, very different. The female will lay an egg that's fairly large. It's about the size of a marble. And she will hold it in her pectoral, try again, Karen. She will hold it in her pelvic fins, which are, that one's right there as a female, are much, much larger than the pelvic fins on a male. That's a female also. Hopefully a male will swim by soon. Let's see. There's a male. You'll see his pelvic fins are much smaller than that first one we looked at. Her pelvic fins are much larger. So she'll let, that one's a different kind of catfish called a gaff top seal catfish. So the female will lay an egg, hold it in her pectoral, pelvic fins, and then she will transfer it to the mouth of a male, such as this one here. And the male catfish will then hold the eggs and protect them in his mouth. We call fish that do this mouth brooders. So the hardhead catfish is a mouth brooder. The male catfish will even hold the eggs in his mouth until after they hatch. We had some reproduce here at the Natural Science Museum several years ago. It was kind of cool. There was a male swimming around. He had four little babies in his mouth and you could see four sets of eyeballs every time he opened his mouth to breathe. And I will never forget it because he released them from his mouth on Father's Day. Just one of the many interesting fish that are here at the Mississippi Museum of Natural Science Aquariums. Hope to see you all healthy and well when this is all over. Take care.